Hi, today's video is about uh, uh, parabola and we're going to find the vertex of the parabola by means of the derivative. And then we're going to check our answer by uh, completing the square and putting the equation of the parabola in its standard form. So we know that the uh, standard form of the parabola is x plus 3 quantity squared, no? that is x plus 3 quantity squared minus 2. No? So we're going to check our answers by means of that. No? So we have here an equation, a quadratic uh, equation, which is y is equal to x squared plus 6x plus 7. No? And we'll call it the, our equation 1. No? We'll call it our equation 1. So we're going to find the derivative of y, no? y prime is equal to 2x plus 6. No? And if we have a parabola no? uh, pointing upward, and this vertex here, the, the point of tangency of this vertex here, the slope of that is 0. No? So, so y prime, which is the slope, is equal to 0. So that is equal to 2x plus 6. No? So after that, we find the value of x, which is 2x is equal to negative 6, and x is equal to negative 6 over 2. And our answer for the x is negative 3. This will be our abscissa of the vertex. No? And from equation 1, no, the given equation, we substitute our abscissa of the vertex to the value of x. So y is equal to negative 3 for the squared plus 6. No? So it's negative 3 plus 7 is equal to 9 minus 18 plus 7 is equal to negative 2. So by the derivative, we get the value of h and k to be negative 3 and negative 2. And we're going to check our answers by, uh, by completing the square. So we have the original equation. Uh, the original equation is equal to x squared plus 6x. This 9 here no, uh, will be computed according to the completing the square. The middle term, which is our b, is equal to 6. We divide it by 2, and we square our answer. So 6 over 2, put it squared, and we'll get 9. No? 6 over 2 is equal to 3. And we square it, we get 9. So when we add 9 to this equation, and subtract 9, we are not do doing anything at all. So after completing the square, we factor it out, and we get x plus 3, put it squared. And this one becomes negative 2, which is our k of the vertex, no? of the parabola. So our standard form is uh, x plus 3 equal to the squared minus 2. So the vertex, according to the completing the square, is negative 3 over 2. Negative 3 and negative 2. So our first answer is also correct. No? That's how we're going to use the... Uh, uh, derivative in finding the vertex of the parabola. So we're going to have some more of this you know, as we go along. So thank you again for watching and after this, after viewing this, please don't forget to su subscribe to my YouTube channel by Will Predator Tan. And uh, after this, uh, uh, if ever, please don't forget also to click also the notification bell. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you again later.